All right. Now I'm going to talk about the uh, most impressive teams from this past weekend. We still got one game left between the Cardinals and the Rams. And one of these teams could be joining the conversation of, okay, blowing these teams out of the water and looking the most impressive and wild card weekend. But as of right now, from Saturday's games, from Sunday's games, which teams looked the best? I'm going to narrow it down to three teams. I'm going to go from the third best all the way down to the number one best, most impressive looking team from this past weekend. Number three, I'm going to say it's the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Now, they were at the at the point of being 31 to nothing in that game, which was great, which is fantastic. But the reason I don't want to put them up at number two or number one is because the pace of the game was a little bit slow. Like they slowly but surely scored those 31 points. And also, given the fact that you almost let the Eagles come back and only won by two possessions, it's still an impressive victory. But the fact that you let the Eagles come back and have a glimpse and a glimmer of hope of eventually coming back and winning this game, i got to rank you guys at number three. Number two, Kansas City Chiefs. And the reason why I don't put them at number one, even though they were just passing the ball 400 yards passing from, from uh, Patrick Mahomes, Travis Kelsey got in on the fun of, of throwing a passing touchdown, Tyreek Hill looking impressive, Jarek McKinnon as well. The fact that I don't put them at number one is because in the beginning, the first quarter of that game, it started off slow. The Steelers, whatever they wanted to happen in the first quarter of that game happened. Like they wanted to win the the coin toss. They wanted to get the ball first because they wanted to slow the momentum of the Chiefs. They knew that if the Chiefs came out first quarter, first opening drive, they would have thrown pass after pass after pass, touchdown, would have shifted the momentum of that game. They wanted to slow things out. Even though it was a three and out, they were able to punt the ball back and the Chiefs got another three and out. And they were able to hold them to zero inter- or zero zero score, get some interceptions. But then after that, they kind of just... You know, the Chiefs kind of broke loose and looked impressive after that. But the first quarter kind of worried me because it looked like the glimmer of the three and four Kansas City Chiefs that we saw in the beginning half of this season. So, yeah, I, I got to put the Chiefs down at number two. But the m- number one most impressive showing from this past weekend, you got to hand it to the Buffalo Bills. There was no team that was more impressive than the Bills this past weekend. And I don't even say this because of the score. Scor- scoring 47 points. Not scoring a single field goal, not scoring or not having a single punt in that game, not a single turnover. I think that's the first time in a postseason game that's ever happened that a team has put up over 40 points and has, hasn't had a punt, a turnover, or a field goal converted in that game. That's all impressive. But the reason I put them down as the number one team is because of the level of competition. They face a Patriots team that is not that bad. They face a Patriots defense that is not that bad. And that offense, clicking, clicking, motor. Devin Motor Singletary getting it done on the ground with over 80 rushing yards. Josh Allen getting it done on the ground and through the air. Dawson Knox being his favorite target. This Bills team is a team that I would be scared of. And if I'm the Kansas City Chiefs who lost to the Bills earlier this season at Arrowhead, you're going to have to game plan differently. Now, the Bills have slipped up throughout the season at times. So they are beatable. But the most impressive team so far that I saw from Wild Card Weekend, just from the Wild Card Weekend, not including the Tennessee Titans or the Green Bay Packers, just the wild card teams, the Buffalo Bills, are the most impressive. Leave your thoughts, leave your opinions, leave your comments. Would love to hear your thoughts.